Constantino. Ole. Pound for pound. Middle Giant Boxing. What, what was learned tonight? What was learned tonight? Um, you know, uh, how to keep my head, keep my cool. You know, we passed that test, and at the end of the day, that's, that's what my dad was emphasizing. I knew this guy, his fight was to get in the inside and make it rough and dirty. But he was doing all this rough stuff. I could have tensed up, I could have uh, wasted unnecessary energy, but I didn't. I let him do whatever he wanted to do. And at the end of the day, I just uh, I went with the flow, and, and uh, you know, we caught him with the shot. We used our intelligence, and so we got the victory. What did you tell him when you dropped him? After you dropped him, you told him something. Uh, I said, I said, levántate, puto. That's what I told him. So, that means get up, my friend. Yeah, my friend, my good friend. <laughs> you didn't spit on like Ross Thompson? Well, I mean, look, you know, it's like, that's a different story. That's a different story because, you know, Ross sucker put me at the press conference. So I said like this, he made a street fight outside the ring, I'm going to make a street fight inside the ring. So I can, I can, you know, it's totally different. He was just, you know, talking smack and saying that he was going to, that he wasn't nothing, that he was gonna, you know, knock him out and everything, but, you know, so it's two different things, so maybe one day, you know, it happens, and unfortunately, I don't want it to happen, but if it happens, it happens, you know, I don't want, not something that I say, hey, he's spinning that his face. No, none of that. What you know, what about, we're, we're, we're sportsmanship. We're, we're sportsmanship. What is sportsmanship? We, 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 we carry great sportsmanship. We're not going to be doing nothing like that. Where did the trash talk come from? Um, you know, he's just trying to hype himself up. Uh, at the end of the day, the press conference, or, I mean, uh, the, the, the weigh-ins. But, you know, at the end of the day, you know, it's just we and you in there. Your, your trainer can help you. The talking, sure, didn't help him. So, um, it's just, I just, even though, you know, you saw I was doing little things here and there, I never lost my cool. I kept my composure, and at the end of the day, uh, you know, we gave the fans a great show. Do you have some of the, the things that Morales and Pereira just uh, told you to translate no. some of the stuff? Yeah, they were just, man, uh, they were giving me props, and for, for them to give me props, um, you know, two great Mexican legends is something that I aspire to be one day, to give the boxing fans great fights like that. Um, man, you're talking about the pinnacle boxing, you know, so... Uh, I just I just want to be remembered the way they're, they're remembered and they're praised and at the end of the day, uh, you know, we just got to keep on getting into the lab and, you know, I'm fighting in four weeks, so I'm back on it. Emilio, how'd you feel when you walked out the crowd was loving it? It sounded uh, like a main event. No, man, uh, you know, God is the greatest, you know, uh, so I want to be here without him and, uh, you know, it's just it's just a blessing, man. I walk with favor and, and uh, you know, we put on a great performance. What's you your you biggest the fight? What's that? What'd you make of the fight? How did it look? Uh, he did great. You know what I mean? But there's, uh, there's just, just like little stuff like that you guys don't see. I'm like, I didn't want him on the ropes at all. And he was kind of going on the ropes a little bit. I'm like, you know, whenever your right foot touches, your, touches the ropes, I need you to go box out. Yeah. So, I give him an eight. I'm not going to give him a ten. No. You know, uh, you know, if you, if, if not, not granted. If he, if he, if, if he didn't do what, what I told him to do, then uh, then I would be like, oh man, you're not listening. But he did everything I told him to do. When, when I told him I need him off the ropes, not to be touching the ropes, he didn't, he didn't go back on. So, you know, it's improvement. That's what you need as a young, young champ, young fighter. What's been your biggest improvement in the past, like, six months? I think, um, you know, keeping my, high, my tight guard, my high guard, and, uh, you know, switching from an amateur style to a pro style. You know, not trying to take any shots and unnecessary shots and just uh, picking up the defense. Do you think he was trying to get you out of that today? The way oh, he was trying to hurt me, destroy me, put me on the floor, knock me out. He was trying to do everything, uh, get into my head. But, you know, my dad kept uh, reminding me to keep my composure and, and I did it. When are you back? I'm back uh, September. I can't say <laughs> September. Hands out of the bear. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> going, going forward, like, you can't teach speed. It's something you're kind of just born with. <laughs> How big of an asset is that for you going I, I, I knew I was quicker than him. I knew I was sharper than him, so I was going to use my brain and, uh, uh, you know, just be one step ahead of him, you know, using feints, looking down, coming up, looking up, coming down. So, you know, this is boxing, man. This is art. This is a, uh, a sport, a sweet science. So, you know, this is not just two dudes throwing punches. Uh, you know, I thought in there, and that's what gave me that, that extra edge over Because if I brawl with him, that's his fight. Yes. This is two people throwing punches. You've been uh, finding guys and knocking them out with your power shots without really using the jab much so far through, through some right. of these fights. Do you feel like that's something that will show more? Yeah, I, 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 look, man, the more the more we do rounds or whatever is necessary for me to get the job done, if I feel like using my jab more, I always want to improve, you know, so this is the, the best version you'll see of me. I'm, I'm only 19 years old. I want to be a world champion. Um, and I know to get there, I'm going to have to use a lot more tricks out of the bag. And, uh, you know, it's, it's going to be, you know, a great, great time of improvement and uh, every fight. Thank you, guys. Thank, Thank you, man.